I'm Sabrina Register at the Governor's Mansion in Olympia for the special Comcast Newsmakers. Every Washington governor has lived at the mansion since 1909. Coming up, a conversation with its newest residents. Governor Inslee, First Lady Trudy Inslee, thank you so much yes. for having us here today. Thank it's a real you. pleasure. The mansion, more than a century old. Mm -hmm. The main floor, public, and you all are up on the second floor, which I'm not sure a lot of people know. You're right. Most people think that we live down here, and this is actually a museum, living history, uh, that was um, started in the 70s when the mansion was going to be torn down possibly and Nancy Evans got people together and they started the Governor's Mansion Foundation which is a nonprofit which funds the uh, furniture and the art here for everybody to enjoy and there's tours here every Wednesday and we live upstairs in our living quarters which is very comfortable but not quite as fancy as here. <laughs> <laughs> Governor do you have a, a favorite room in the mansion? Oh well wherever Trudy is of course that's the, <laughs> that's the first answer but the second answer, Good answer. The second answer is uh, is really the library. Uh, it's really an extraordinary collection of, of books about the state of Washington, by Washington authors, and also a national really repository of kind of a democratic history of our democracy. So the full writings of, of George Washington and his entire collection of anything he ever wrote. Uh, histories, the personal library of uh, the first governor of the state of Washington, who is a personal friend of Abraham Lincoln, are, is in our library. So whenever I'm thinking about the issues of transportation or Boeing jobs and, you know, I can come down and read about what George Washington was going through <laughs> during the Revolutionary War. And it gives you a certain context of what you're, I'm dealing with. And uh, it's a wonderful, wonderful uh, attribute to have a governor have that uh, to be accessible. It sounds like you're a history buff. Yeah, and I, you know, it's like it is a certain inspiration and comfort to see what other leaders in their time, and every time has a particular challenge, to see how they deal with things that are, uh, you know, large or, or very pedestrian. You know, it's kind of interesting, I was reading the other night about Washington worrying about the, the type and size of tents they were buying, you know, for the, for the soldiers during the Valley Forge winter and, and just putting whatever problems we've got now into perspective <laughs> is, is of value. Yeah, absolutely. Talk a little bit about um, some of the other things, historic items or, or just some, some other things in the house like the art and the silver because mm -hmm. it's, a, it's really amazing here mm -hmm. when you walk around and you're able yeah, to look. Yeah, it's a great collection. The, most of the furniture was purchased from Frederick and Nelson. Um, that is in the dining room and the bedrooms and all, but the Mansion Foundation purchased other furniture for some of the other rooms. It's much older than the building itself, but I think the prize piece is the George Washington painting. Yeah, we had just a beautiful portrait of George Washington. It really is exquisite, and uh, you know, our, our state was uh, graciously named. Actually, the first person who thought of our name <laughs> of our state was Thomas Jefferson who suggested six names for potential uh, states in, in the Louisiana Purchase, and one of them was Washington. And I think we really lucked out with that name and, and that leadership vision. So we've got a beautiful portrait um, uh, of him. Uh, but by there's Rick. by just some wonderful things. We've got the, uh, the silver from uh, Admiral Dewey's warship, the Olympia, that really led the Battle of Manila Bay in the beginning of the Spanish American War, and so the silver from that ship named after the city of Olympia that led that uh, really first sort of international uh, effort by the state of Washington is right here. So you can look around here, there's always a little bit of history, and we got a great history and a great future, so it's a great state. We're almost out of time. A special room for you? Oh, gosh. I think this room, this is where I spend most of my time in meetings and with family and friends, yeah. Governor Inslee. Happy holidays. Happy holidays, Trudy. Thank you, you so too. much. And thanks for watching Comcast Newsmakers. Mm -hmm.